What is up you guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new here my name is Brie Monet and today's video is going to be from love me hair so we're just going to jump right into the hair so while I'm plucking I'm going to tell you guys about the wig so I do the one two three move method as y'all can see so this is a dark plum color it's loose wave undetectable invisible lace and it's a middle part and it's supposed to be a glueless wig um and I believe I got the length 12 inches and yes it was pre-plucked Next, I'm just going to take my no mousse and I'm going to place that on top of the wig and I'm going to comb that through. Next, I'm just going to take my wax stick and I'm going to do the exact same thing. Next, I'm just going to take my hot comb and I'm going to press down on the wig so this way my hair can lay flat. So this is the inside of the wig. This is what the lace looks like. And of course, it comes with a band. Um, you also have your combs. A lot of people don't like the fact that it's not an attachable band. This one's actually sewn in. So I just want to let you know. So this is me putting on the wig. And I put the band on first. And then I put the combs in. And this is what the lace looks like up close without anything on it. And next, I'm just going to cut it off and put some makeup that's my color and then you can also wear this with glueless and this is what it will look like if you did but without further ado let's get into the review okay you guys so this is the wig and y'all um after a couple of tries i like it better this way so this is my second time recording the first time i really didn't like it i wore it glueless um and i think because i wore it glueless i didn't really like it the lace was lifting up and then on top of that i just wasn't really feeling the curls and i just really wasn't feeling this wig to me it was giving wig vibes like you could tell and i was like i really don't like this so i use like a spray glue and that works better for me when i'm doing like wigs like this as you can see this is what the lace is giving right now like i said we never have problems with the lace over here at love me here do y'all not see what it's giving oh okay like i said um i curled my hair a little bit more just because i'm not really a big fan of the loose wave beach wave whatever kind of curls you would like to call it to me i hate them i don't like them on me i don't like them on wigs i probably don't really like them on short wigs but curls like this i'm okay with they also didn't want me to put baby hairs i'm really feeling the no baby hair look now i don't know I think now that I plucked it, it looks a little bit more natural than I had it the first time. The first time I didn't really go in and pluck it as much just because I was kind of scared because of the way that the wig is set up. It's not like a full lace um, type situation. It You actually have limited space. So you can't pluck right here because if you do, you're going to show the track. Um, so you can only really pluck right here. I don't know, like out of the pack, it looks synthetic at first. And I was like um ma'am what is this i don't know the color was weird like it didn't look like i dyed my hair it kind of gave me like a synthetic kind of color actually really surprised because i love this color um i actually have a headband wig in this color i was wearing that joint for <laughs> for like the longest you no know, that fall is about to come around because these dark plum colors this is what i call it because it's almost like a reddish purplish hue type of color but it's darker but this color right here is perfect for the fall if i could get every kind of simple wig that you could throw my way this color i would wear it so yeah that's how i know fall is about to come around because they done gave me a wig this color when it comes to shedding there's no shedding unless you're plucking the wig so this is why i say the wig comes curled already but if you're going to pluck the wig you're going to have to you know comb through the wig so you're going to have to recurl it um it is a chance that it could get tangled at the ends um i know for me it did you have this wonderful option of either wearing it glueless or glue down me personally i like this um better when it's glued down so let me spin around so you guys can see the whole entire wig when i said i wanted wig companies to come out with something new i'm not sure if this is new or not but you know it's new to me because they sent it to me this is what i'm talking about because like 
I understand the whole normal you want deep wave, but it's brown or the whole blonde. I get it. I do. But me personally, I want a color. I want something new to spice things up. And this right here will definitely do it. But as you can see, she does hold on to curls because this is like the back part is like two day curls. So um, I don't have a problem with that. Y'all, this is a big difference from yesterday because yesterday I was not feeling this wig at all. I was literally about to give up on it. I said, heck no, no. No, y'all was about to get the real y'all was about to get the real deal on this review. I was about to be like, I don't like it. <laughs> so if I had to rate this wig from one to ten, we're gonna give it a good girl. What we gonna give you? I would give her a good eight. What's carrying the wig for me is the color, honestly. But other than that, um, the wig is perfectly fine. So that is all I have for you guys today. And if you're looking to purchase this wig or anything else that they may have on their website, make sure you check out the description box down below. Also, check out my Amazon storefront, like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all my social medias. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!